Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Takeshi Uchiyamada, chairman of Toyota Motor Corporation. I'm very honored and humbled to be speaking here in this historic ceremony. Our CEO, Akio Toyoda, is grandson of the Akichiro. When he heard, first heard about this news, he really wanted to take part in celebrating this, his grandfather as a grandson than a CEO. He couldn't be here physically today, but he asked me to share his feeling through a video message. So, please take up the look. Big news for Toyota. Kichiro Toyoda has been inducted to the Automotive Hall of Fame. I'm so grateful because America was my aspiration. Automobile, driving around the motor city, what I saw there was the starting point of Toyota's foundation. You may be surprised to know that Toyota makes cars in America now. It is very impressive. I devoted my whole life to accomplishing made by the Japanese. But I could not imagine that one day someone could say Toyota proudly made in America by Americans. Toyota must be supported by a huge number of American people, including team members, suppliers, dealers, and above all, U.S. customers who support a brand and cars. Let me use this chance to thank all these people. By the way, who are you anyway? I'm Akio Toyoda, your grandson. Oh, what do you do now? I work for an automobile company. Hmm, I hope it's Toyota. Well, this was a surprise, wasn't it? <laughs> but here's the thing. Our CEO was so happy and the really wished that Kichiro could have been here to thank you for this honor. So he made it happen. Indeed, I'm quite sure Kichiro Toyoda would be extremely grateful because it was America that started his automotive journey. I'd like to sincerely thank members of the Automotive Hall of Fame for recognizing our founder. Kichiro founded Toyota but his challenge wasn't just about making a car. His real ambition was to establish an entire industry to make a car in his country. It was such a venture at the time because the industrial bases didn't exist in Japan. In 1930, only 20,000 vehicles produced in Japan, mostly by GM and Ford, while in the US, more than 5 million vehicles were produced at the same time. This is a picture of the shed where our first car, Toyota Model AA, displayed in the hallway was developed. How state of the art? It wasn't much, but 
Kichiro and his team started their journey from this small shed. They didn't have knowledge and expertise in car manufacturing, nor the supplier base or dealer network. But it was the passion and vision for a better society that was driving them. Such determination gradually inspired other leaders and eventually led to form a strong and capable industry. Without each other's challenging spirit and persistent effort, Toyota wouldn't be here today. And without innovation he came up with, such as the famous just-in-time concept, our industry across the globe might not have been capable to grow and develop the way it has. We believe that he laid important foundations for the industry. But unfortunately, he was never able to witness this success. And that is why we are so happy about this recognition, as you could see in our CEO's video. I appreciate everyone here for being with us to celebrate our founder. We are proud of him to be honored like this in the greatest automotive country in the world. Thank you very much.